Carlos coming. Do it now. Dance with me, Jackie. Fucking pal, what are you doing here? And where the hell are we? You let stupid stuff get in your head, then it gets all jumbled and weird, and people think you're nuts! Come find me, Jackie. Hello. Tony, Tony, what happened? Did you find the guys who hit us at the restaurant? Sometimes I can't tell the difference between a fruit and a vegetable. Jesus Christ, what is this place? I gotta get out of here. I like grapes. I don't like beans. I like strawberries, though. Over here! Jesus Christ, Jackie, we thought you was dead. What happened back there? I, uh... I handle things, like I always do. What the hell's going on, Tony? Hell if I know, boss. Look, we gotta get out of here. 
You go in your limo, and I'll go ride in the car with Vinny. He busted up a couple of ribs, but he's gonna be fine. The first time you use the darkness, it scares you. But once you've tasted it, you can't stop. That's all you think about. Like I said, it consumes you. Every second of every day for the last two fucking years, I kept myself in check. Gritted my teeth and kept it buried. Oh, now it's back. And I can feel what it's doing to me. So, uh, I guess setting you up with the twins didn't go so good, huh? Yeah, no shit. I'm glad you're all right, Vin. Now, can you tell me what the fuck just happened? I don't know. I saw some weird-looking guy had a limp. It was crazy. Like, one minute he's there, the next minute the guy just fucking disappears. I don't know, I must have hit my head or something. Look, anyways, Jimmy says he's got a lead on the crew that hit us. Good. Now find Jimmy. Tell him to meet me in my office. I'm gonna head upstairs. Yeah, sure, whatever you need, Jackie. Oh, yeah. You don't get it. You'll never Hello. get it. Hello! On the water, on my boat, I can just Looks like you ruined another I suit. Get any younger. About time I take it easy, you know? Careful, sir. Jackie, how you doing? I'm pissed off, boys. We're gonna find these fucks. Jimmy's got some info already. How the fuck's that guy know everything? He's a goddamn encyclopedia. Encyclopedia? Listen to you. Like you ever cracked a book in your life. <clears throat> this fucking guy, right? If he wasn't already married to my sister, I'd have to punish him by introducing him all over again. You talk shit, but I know we're gonna see you for dinner on Sunday. Hey, Jackie. You say the word, and we're ready to go. We got your back, boss. Thanks a lot, boys. Now drink up. It's gonna be a long night. You know what your problem is? What, aside from you? Your problem, asshat, is you ain't never been in love. I love my boat. That don't count. I love drinking. No, no, no. Real love with a person. Like I said, in love. Oh, and you have? Yeah, I've been in love. I'm in love right now. With my wife, <laughs> with my mistress. Hell, I even love that whole Camille from the other night. <laughs> yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> Steve's assholes, come on. Ranger gets captured by a bunch of fucking criminals. When those bad guys backs a turn, Lord Ranger sees up on the hill across the valley his best buddy Tano. Yeah, the Indian. No, the Native American. All right, all right, Native American. Okay, so the Lone Ranger can't escape. He's surrounded by all these assholes, right? But when nobody's looking, he snags a blanket and gets his ass over to the campfire. Where did he get a blanket? Hey, what do you fucking care? I bet it was a saddle blanket. Fine, genius. A saddle blanket. Okay, Lone Ranger grabs a fucking saddle blanket and starts fanning over the fire. Hey, sending smoke signals to the ink. The Native American, right? Fucking A right. He's sending a smoke signal. Tano sees the signal, nods, and tears his ass out of there. Now, when Tano comes back, He's got this beautiful blonde with big ass titties with him, right? <laughs> yeah? Lone Ranger sees the blonde and shakes his head no. So the Lone Ranger fans the fire, sending Tano the smoke signal again. Tano sees it, nods, then races off. This time, he comes back with a hot, long legged brunette bitch, right? <laughs> right. Lone Ranger sees this chick, shakes his head again. No. Fans the flame, sends the same smoke signal a third time. Off Tano goes. This time, he brings back a smoking redhead, right? Lone Ranger finally drops the blanket, just yells across the valley at the top of his fucking lungs. 
I said posse, you <laughs> asshole! Ah, <laughs> uh, shit. I don't know. It just don't seem right. I think the guy's fucking nuts. You think the boss is a nut job? What, you don't? What did you say? Oh, hey, Jackie. Looking good, boss. Jackie, uh, let us know what you need, okay? Jackie. Jackie, don't take this the wrong way, but I got a sausage over here with your name on it. See, I knew you'd take it the wrong way. Jackie, you are the fucking hot sauce on the steak that is the Franchetti family. You crazy son of a bitch. You're too thin, Jackie. You don't eat enough good food. There, I said it. I wonder about all those moments lost in time. Like tears in the rain. Then I'm like, fuck it, make a sandwich, it'll be okay. I love this place, I mean, it makes me happy. Gee, better than being a miserable thin fuck, am I right? I went to the opera the other day. That fat Viking bitch had to be the most beautiful girl I've ever seen. Why do people say the world is my oyster? It'd be more realistic if they said the world is my hungry man TV dinner or something. I had some of that gourmet chocolate the other day, flavored with goji berries and curry spices. Made me shit for a fucking week. I'm gonna find the prick who says that was a good idea and put a fucking Hershey bar right up his ass. So you can't trust someone who's too thin. Look at Dolfo. What a fucking nutbag. I need some nutrition. Cuckoo! If you drop a piece of bread, you want to know why it always lands butter side down? Because you're a dickhead for dropping perfectly good food, that's why. Take Babe Ruth. There's a true sportsman. Not like some of these fucking homos they got in right field these days. They named a candy bar after him. Hey, boss, you good? Someone's gonna pay for this shit. Hey, the good news is you got the old Jackie magic back. Good to see we're back in business with that thing you do, Jackie. Nothing on that crippled guy yet, boss. No word on our guy at the back door yet, Jackie. I put the word around on that crippled guy. Nothing yet. Well, okay. 